What's up guys? It's your boy Ty Skits here and today we're playing Car X Drift Racing Online. In today's Car X Drift Racing Online video, I'll be showing you guys the best ultimate drift setup for the GT530 aka the Mustang GT350. So, what you guys want to go ahead and do is purchase the Cobra GT530 and purchase the ultimate setup and then come over to your dyno stand. Your front spring length is going to be 12, your rear spring length is going to be 9, your front spring stiffness is going to be 100, your rear spring stiffness is going to be 120, your front shock stiffness is going to be 70, your rear shock stiffness is going to be 60, your front toe is going to be uh, 0 0.49, negative 0 0.49, your rear toe is going to be 0 0.21, your front camera is going to be negative 3.69, your rear camera is going to be negative 1.44. Your front and rear anti roll bar are going to be 20, your caster is going to be 9.0, and your Ackerman is going to be 35%. For your max steering angle, it's going to be 56 degrees. For your wheels, your front and rear rim diameter are going to be 20, your front tire width is going to be 325, your rear tire width is going to be 285, your front and rear tire pressure are going to be 190, your front and rear wheel adhesion are going to be 120, your front wheel track is going to be 18, your rear base is going to be 8, your front and rear tire profile are going to be 25%. For your engine, your engine tune is going to be at 5%, your max torque is going to be at 4,767, your rev limiter is going to be at 9,000, your turbocharger is going to be on, and you want to leave your turbocharger air pressure at 0 0.8. It's very specific that you leave it at 0 0.8. You can go ahead and turn it up if you want, but it's going to make your car spin out way too much, so I would leave it at 0 0.8. For your transmission, your diff lock ratio is going to be 1.00, your final drive is going to be 420, uh, your gear 1 is going to be 4.80, gear 2 is going to be 1.70, gear 3 is going to be 1.35, gear 4 is going to be 1.20, gear 5 is going to be 1.15, and gear 6 is going to be 1.10. For your brakes, your brake torque is going to be 4749, and your front brake bias is going to be 75%. ABS, no. Launch control, no. Once you guys have this tune in your car, it should drift a little bit something like this. If you found this video helpful, make sure to drop a like on this video. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss a stream, montage, or a tuning video. I'm going to be putting out two tune videos a day. Today, I put out the Ryan Turk GT4586 tune. And today, I'm also putting out, as you guys can see now, the Mustang RTR created by Von Gittin Jr. So as you guys can see, there's the tune right here. This team does 360s and it also does reverse entries. As you guys can see there, I did a 360. It also does some pretty smooth reverse entries on the key. As you guys can see there, we got reverse entries. You can hit a bigger one also. I hit like a small one right there. You can hit bigger reverse entries in this car. Man. I'm telling you, this car is amazing. Same with the Ryan's Turk car. These are both amazing builds. I hope you guys enjoy these builds. Like I said. So like I said, man, if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications so you never miss a stream or an upload. This is Matthias Gets playing Car Extra Racing. And I'll see you guys next time.